Students attend alternative school Miami Douglas MacArthur Senior High South because of truancy, drugs, or a myriad of other problems. Some of them were even members of street gangs. Today we are here to visit our friends from Neva King Cooper School, where we make them laugh, we touch their lives, and that makes us feel good inside. These students are getting a second chance. At this school, they are made to feel special, worthy, and intelligent. They help others who, like them, are fighting a battle, but on a very different field, that of physical and mental disability. We feel good because they are so happy playing with us, they really like it. The teachers say that on the day these activities take place, there is a 100% attendance record. It seems that no one wants to be absent. These are the same indifferent rebels who, when they see their disabled friends, become eager to teach them to paint or play basketball. Here they have found a reason to go to class. I never wanted to go to school before. I had many problems then. Now I have no problems. Julio Mateo enjoys art, and it is that passion he wants to share. I like to draw. This painting of Julio's, a worker planting like his father, and so many more he knows in the Homestead area, has won several awards. Even former Florida First Lady Columba Bush bought and kept a reproduction. The young men and women from MacArthur who helped this school seem to have learned a very valuable lesson. Helping others is the best way to help ourselves. These students also visit senior citizen centers, reading the newspaper and just keeping the residents company. The students bring youth into the center, they bring a, a, a vibrance, a life that we don't have unless they come. And the seniors give the students a little bit of mellow, quiet, calming um, advice that they realize, that the students realize are coming from somebody who's lived a, a lifetime and has experienced all the good and all the bad that there is and that they, they'll pick up on all the good things that they have. Well, when I get, when I come over here and I spend time with them, like I usually come out differently than when I came in. I feel like a different person. These kids tend to rebel in a classroom setting. They don't want to read, they don't want to participate. But here, they voluntarily and willingly participate. Well, I think it's a wonderful experience. We have fun with them, they make us laugh, and we laugh with them, and it's really nice. It seems that their fate is reflected in these people, and it affects them. It motivates them. They see that the elderly need support and love at this time in their life. It is easy to understand how these MacArthur South students, whose histories are riddled with family and gang violence, seem converted by their new friends. When we tried to ask one of them a question, the young man simply gave me a hug. It was then that I realized that the genuineness and spontaneity of their spirit is what helped change the alternative school students' lives forever.